hello everyone so in today's video we will be going over how to transfer geometry from Revit into Rhino there are many ways to transfer geometry over into Rhino uh, today we will be looking at Rhino inside Revit as our tool to transfer over geometry I feel this is one of the cleanest and latest ways uh, in which we can cut down a lot of time on building two separate models one in Rhino and the other one in Revit instead we can build parts of it wherever it needs to be developed so part of it could be developed in Rhino it could be pushed into Revit uh, develop it further move it back into Revit so it's a Rhino Revit back and forth uh, process but today we will be looking at uh, Revit to Rhino process so to do that first we open our Rhino when you open Rhino you will have a clean uh, Rhino file with nothing in it so right now we are running Rhino but that's running inside Revit so it may seem like inception a little bit but once you'll get hang of it uh, it will all start to make sense uh, currently we are using uh, a file that's developed by Scott Davidson over at McNeil I will be posting a link in the description below where to get the file so once we have the file open you can see that you can pick a category from your Revit file and bake that geometry into Revit into Rhino so let's look at the script real quick so how do you know what you are picking from your Revit file is I go to the Revit and pick the uh, geometry for which we have selected the category so this is all the roof components I turn them off and let me turn on all the walls from my Revit so here you can see that you can pick all the all the walls that are in your Revit model right now so as a next step uh, right now you can see that those models those uh, walls are also here in your Rhino but they are not baked like that's not the geometry in Rhino right now uh, but let's say if you want to bake it then you have a tool that's uh, it's a toggle button you press the toggle and it will start the process of converting that into geometry this is a very helpful and very fast clean way to transfer geometry and you can also group all of them and move them to a layer that you want to uh, place in so once it's r done running the process you can see that the geometry has been transferred into your Rhino now you can select all of them and move them to the layer change object layer and move all of them into the wall layer now let's look at roof for example so this is the roof for the model uh, let me turn off the walls and we want to bake roof geometry into our Rhino so to do that we press the toggle button and it will start creating roof exactly the way it is in our Revit model so I feel this is a very quick and fast way to m model back and forth and you can see that it's a true roof it's a mm, 
trimmed surface so I can extrude, scale it, make modifications if I like. So that's it for today and hope you enjoy this video. Thank you so much.